guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. And today we are making my famous cheese dip. <laughs> okay, so uh, we I make this every year at Thanksgiving or Christmas dinners that we have. Um, so the ingredients that you are gonna need is bacon, like six slices of bacon. You chop them up into little squares like that. And then you get your, you need two cups of mild cheddar cheese, two cups full of those. Then you're going to need one little cup of sour cream and three eight ounces of cream cheese. Green onion goes in it, but I'm allergic to green onion, so I can't use it today. But when we do have family, uh, family uh, events and everything, we, I put green onion in it or my mom does because I can't touch it. But yeah, this is what we're gonna make today. <laughs> okay, first, what we're gonna do is you're gonna put the bacon in the pan. Just spread it around a little bit. And then we're gonna take it over to the oven and make sure it gets good and crisp. Can't get it on. <laughs> You don't hurt yourself <laughs> and then put it in the oven I would say for about 10 15 minutes so we'll come back to that when it's done okay you guys so while the bacon is cooking we are gonna go ahead and start mixing everything up you're gonna want to put, put the bleh, sorry <laughs> you're gonna want to put the sour cream in first with the cream cheese and I don't use a spoon to mix it up I use my hands well I have gloves on but it's a lot funner this way so you want to mix this up first ew, ew, I hate that sound though it up and put it into the to the seat. It's still kind of hot so be careful not to burn yourselves if y'all want to make this Now you're just going to want to 
break the big pieces up into a little bit and then you're going to want to mix it okay now we are going to use the same pan that the uh, bacon was in we used the napkin that we uh that the grease was poured on and we just smeared it around and we're just going to take this and start putting it in the pan. Make sure you get every last bit of it out of this pan. So we're going to take it to the oven. Going to turn it back on. <laughs> Leave it at 350. And you're going to cook this for about 15 minutes. And then after that, we will sprinkle more mild cheese on top of it. Put it back in for another 5 minutes and then it'll be done. It's been about 15 minutes now. And so now what we're going to do is put, uh, get a handful of the mild cheese and just sprinkle it on top. You don't want a lot of cheese on top, but just enough to cover the, the whole thing. Alright, now we're going to put it back in the oven for about five minutes. for the taste test. <laughs> that was really good. <laughs> okay guys, well, um, this is just a um, basic, I guess, dip you would say, but um, you can use it for anything. You can add broccoli in it, chicken in it, even noodles to make a like a cheese and bacon macaroni and cheese still. <laughs> but yeah, this is just, it goes perfectly with the dip too. So y'all can make this. It's easy. It's very cheap. What'd you think, Mom? <laughs> Alright, well, um, thank you guys for so much watching. If you're new here, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, make sure you like that, the, click that like button, and comment down below what you want me to do next. Thank you guys.